Hi guys, just returned from camp and I just wanted to share with you why I, I like to take the team away to a place where there's sand for us to run on. So you can see from the guys running on the hard surface here that obviously we're trying to generate maximum distance per step and we're going to do that by using the elastic um, properties of the lower limbs. Um, what the sand is going to do, it's going to train the runner or the triathlete to pull their foot off the ground quicker and not slam their foot into the ground, which in itself will um, increase the injury rate of the athlete. So we're looking to get maximum distance per step using those hamstrings, using those glutes to fire us across the ground. What we'll see, because the sand is obviously unstable, is it also is gonna work on those other postural muscles and keep us nice and tall and making sure we're nice and economic with each foot step. What the guys will report is when they go back onto hard surface, they feel like they're floating across the ground, but you'll also notice that there's a silence to their running as well. So they're not slamming those feet down into the ground anymore. They're, they're really looking to be light and with nice quick foot strike. Most elite runners are running with around 98 steps per minute. And this in itself, the quiet, nice, quiet, quiet, but quick foot strike is gonna make you a much more economical runner.